Welcome back. Today's book is called I Am an Artist by Pat Lowry Collins, illustrated by Robin Brickman. I am an artist when I find a face in a cloud or watch the light change the shape of a hill. I am an artist when I look through a sun shower for a rainbow. I am an artist when I find one. I am an artist when I shoot water loops in the air with a hose or discover pictures in drops of rain. I am an artist when I cut an apple to see the star inside, or when I watch sunlight turn dust to glitter. I am an artist when I crunch through crusted snow and stop to gather winter's hush around me. I am an artist when I look at a bird until I feel feathery too, and at an orange until I know what it is to be perfectly round. I am an artist when I run my fingers over a shiny pod or across the rough bark of a tree, or when I blow on a full-blown milkweed and it splinters into tiny white puffs. Or when I pick up a maple tree seed and send it spinning back to earth by its own twin propellers. I'm an artist when I see that the sun comes up in a soft haze and goes down in a fiery blaze. I'm an artist when I wait for a star to streak through the night sky, or when I sit very still in the woods and listen. I'm an artist whenever I look closely at the world around me, and whenever you listen and search and see. You are an artist too. So this book really makes me want to just go outside and look and listen and see what you see. You can take a piece of paper and a crayon that's been peeled and put it against the tree and rub the bark and look at the different kinds of bark. Or you can just make pictures, collages outside without any glue of the things that you find or collections. Some people like to make collections. When you pay attention to the world around you, you're an artist too. Well, until next time, bye-bye.